Hi, I'm Rick Bunting with Drive It Systems. I'm the manager for prefabricated solutions. We're here today to introduce to you our new Federlite M system. The Federlite M is a modified version of our traditional Federlite panel system that uses a strictly mechanically fastened method of attachment. The first step is installing the mounting rail, which is installed based on the configuration of your panel or 24 inches on center. In some cases with higher wind load demands, it could be as much as 12 inches. For the purpose of this mock-up, we have them set at approximately 12 inches. And as you can see behind each fastener, we place a horseshoe shim. That horseshoe shim is used to create space between the back of the channel and the wall to allow for any drainage of any incidental moisture that gets behind the panel. If it's a full barrier system, you don't have to have the horseshoe shims there. So, and the fasteners that we use for this step, you have to make sure that your engineer does a pull-out test on the fasteners with the correct stud gauge to make sure that the pull-out will match in the required wind loads for that location as well. So with our Federlite M panel, you can see we have a, a slight modification to our standard panel. This modification has a slight loop on the back. So that's a receiver for the mounting rail. So everything is done strictly by fastening. There's no adhesive used in this type of a panel application. And one other thing we do because the panel is held off the back of the wall, we also put base coat and mesh to help with our fire protection. So that's the Federlite M panel. This is a sand pebble fine finish. And then we have a couple of other different finish types for this purpose of this mock-up. So the panel very simply just goes up against the wall and drops down onto the fastener. And we slide it into position. So we use a spacer to create the joint spacing so we have consistent joint spacing from panel to panel which get a wet sealant joint. And that is it. And then we just put a fastener through the top of the extrusion on the outer portion and into the rail and that locks it in place and we typically will have fasteners on the upper right corner of a panel and the lower left corner um, and that's enough to lock that panel in place and uh, then the next panel coursing you can see the second panel that goes on we're going to co show a little bit of a staggered join here second panel goes on panel gets pressed into the wall and we're going to kind of push down on it that's it when you lay your rails out, you want to make sure that you take into consideration the panel to panel joint. We have to add an extra half an inch or whatever the thickness of this caulk joint is here. We use a cheater stick when we're putting these rails up and we make an adjustment. Whatever we're going to use is our shim for our caulk joint. We put that at the base and use it as a spacer and so that way everything is consistent throughout the whole elevation. So you can use a variety of different finishes. This happens to be a wood grain texture. And then we have an ACM look, which is drive its reflected finish, reflected smooth, which is a sprayed on metallic painting. So it gives the appearance of a ACM panel. The major difference is that the insulation, the mounting rails, everything is all done and built into the panel. So you only have one step to install it, as opposed to putting up furring channel and insulation and then mounting your panels. So that's, that's the Federlite M system.